Last week, one and oh, IUP hosted the eighth ranked Bloomsburg Huskies in a nationally televised game. 3 3 score in the first quarter when Jarrell McFadden gets his hands on this ball and shows off his electrifying speed as he zigs and zags and zips all the way to the house for a 90 yard IUP touchdown. 10 3 Crimson Hawks. They would lead at that point. Let's move to the second quarter, and here come the Huskies. All anybody wanted to talk about was NCAA running back Franklin Quiete. But Pat Carey says, hey, I'm here too, as he finds Dickerson behind the secondary for six. Pat Smith, though, would respond, looking for Jay Vaughn Rowan right here, trying to take a halftime lead before the break. But Holman is wide right on this field goal attempt. So we'll have a 10-10 high game at the half. Pick it up in the third quarter as Pat Carey looks towards the end zone. Kyle Fisher was wearing his PF flyers. He finished with 171 and a touchdown on the day for the Husky. Hawks looking to regain their mojo. James Johnson up and over to foul touchdown. Crimson Hawks, IEP starting to regain their pulse down 20 to 16. But special teams woes once again for IUP. Let them down as Grant Shalek cannot handle the snap on a field goal attempt. IUP unable to muster up a final scoring drive as the Huskies would then prevail, coming away with a 20-16 win on the road. 